happiness and swimming and leisure, family happiness. It's been used by Muslim women around the world, including this Australian surf lifesaver. Right now, though, the burkini is dividing opinion in France. It was banned in around 30 coastal towns and cities, a decision which caused outcry with the release of these photos showing police ordering a woman to take hers off. The ban has just been ruled illegal by France's highest administrative court, but many towns have vowed to keep it in place. Former president and current candidate Nicolas Sarkozy supports them, saying, I'm calling for a law to ban them across the whole country. Hasn't he got anything better to talk about? I mean, doesn't he need to fix his country and not split it apart? France has strict laws against the wearing of religious garb or symbols in public places, which has widespread political and public support. But New Zealand swimwear designer Emma Ford, who showcased her latest collection at Fashion Week in Auckland today, says a ban would never fly here. I think the most important thing is to, to feel confident in what you're wearing. And whether that's a tiny bikini or a burkini, you should be able to embrace either things. Ford says burkinis aren't common in New Zealand and she has no intention of designing them herself. But she reckons swimwear should be the wearer's choice, not a politician's. Adrian Taylor, News Hub.